The other thing is that the layout of the hands on the piano, the hands are oriented opposite each other. So you have thumbs in the middle, fingers on the outside. So if you're thinking about like natural interval spacing on the piano, you're going to be a little bit more comfortable having smaller intervals on the top of a chord or on the outside of a chord rather, or larger intervals between the thumb and the second finger. So on the inside of a chord, uh, there's exceptions, but that's kind of your general layout. The harp is a little bit different, whereas the hands are going to be oriented in the same direction. So thumbs on top, fingers on bottom. Mm -hmm. So if you're thinking about that natural interval spacing, it's always going to be the tops of the chords that you want to have slightly larger intervals. Seconds are a little bit less idiomatic on the top of right. the chord. Not impossible, but it moves the whole hand up, which means you can't reach as far 